Can someone help me, please? Hello? No! Morning Lord, help me! It's gone. Okay, okay, there's a door. Uh, won't open. Damn it! Hello, please, somebody. Who's she? Oh my! No! 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 I need to get out of here. Oh. Oh, where? Okay, okay, this way. Did I tell you the story how I survived the castle? I didn't. What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Untold Odyssey's Curse of Dread. Or no, sorry, Curse of Strahd, wrong game. <clears throat> Curse of Strahd, you're, episode you're, 14. You're treads on, tread, tread, Curse of Dreads on Fridays. Curse of Dreads is in fact on Fridays. <laughs> Curse of Strahd, uh, the, the, the regular Curse of Strahd. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Everybody doing all right? Good. Good. Welcome back after the, uh, what, the, the two, three week hiatus? I think it was two, wasn't two it? Weeks this, one, this one's been two weeks, yeah. Yeah, two yeah. weeks. This is uh, it's not the longest hiatus we've had to take it, but uh, <laughs> no, <laughs> we uh, we 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 were we were down and in, in being at four players when this is campaign is supposed to be set for five, being at four and then having somebody dip out for for any reason, uh, kind of kind of brings you down to three people, and unfortunately. I really didn't want to have an encounter with three people, uh, especially the uh, the deadly encounter that you guys are at. Uh, super deadly encounter, I should say. 
Uh, you're gonna need all the me. help you can get. Uh, I'm fairly certain you guys were all at least able to do uh, um, to do we your all got our long uh, rest. Your long in, yes. rest, yes. We all yes. did. Mm -hmm. yes. Uh, yeah. I gotta I gotta crack open my book again to find the uh, the time that you guys are actually sitting at right now. Oh shit. <sighs> Great because it wasn't even that late when you guys actually decided to start taking a rest so you guys are like literally at like two o'clock in the morning right now it's kind of ridiculous uh you know what does anybody remember what time it was i don't time to get a watch oh, okay. time <laughs> to get a watch i mean you're not wrong um it's one of really don't one have... of the many reasons you need to watch. All right, Orange. From now on, you're my official timekeeper. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> my responsibility. Yeah, all the responsibilities. Uh, you know, you know, you know all the responsibilities. So, uh, because I don't remember uh, what time we are actually at, we're going to call you right now at six a.m. Good job, guys. 6 a.m. Yeah, we uh, made it. Yay. Life. So, we orange. survived the night. Woo. Barely. Okay, we're at it's 6 a.m., you said? Yeah, we're going to say 6 a.m. right now. Because uh, I can't remember, and I really don't want to have to go through all the different stuff to be able to find it. So, 6 a.m. it is. Woo. Okay. <laughs> you remember. I feel like we should say that. <clears throat> all right, Orange. True. Yes. Pull up all your notes as you got to oh. give the recap today. Okay, yeah. what's up, guys? Welcome to session 14 of Curse of Strahd. So yesterday, not yesterday, oops, last session, two weeks ago, I wish it was yesterday, um, we embarked on a journey, right? We embarked on like quite the journey to Good start. get to Valakai, okay? And um, we actually went through quite a few places. Um, just gonna skim past that. We went through this nice bridge with amazing views that we couldn't really appreciate. We met some weird ass vampire people. Um, and before all that though, Kami, huh, during combat, kind of just outed himself as a vampire, but not really, but he did. So that's kind of tense between him and Irina. But yeah, we had like back to back combat, especially with some twigs. I, I don't I think Arena know. knows actually. She doesn't. Well, I mean, she doesn't know. I she's kinda. concerned. Yeah, that's why I said kind of because because like, I was edge. eating. What was I eating? You, you, you ripped a blood. zombie's throat out. No, yes. no, it was. Because oh, remember, wolf. I was collecting wolf. blood. Yeah, well, wolf, like yeah, yeah, and she looked at me weird, like just chop off its leg, guys. Like you never know, might need meat and blood and. Whatever. No, but yeah, she doesn't wrong, know though. yet. No, it isn't wrong though, because Irina first noticed when he did rip out the vampire's throat. That was when she first noticed oh. him. It was like, oh yeah, and I said, well, they were bitey, so you. I bit him back. Yeah, I remember that. That was funny. But um, <laughs> yeah, we had combat, and then we um, we found a camp, and we woke up to werewolves being surrounded by werewolves. Okay. You do in fact, as uh, as we will. Set you in. The big thing that uh that you didn't uh you didn't talk about here. I forgot she missed thing. part of herself. Wait, I did. Yeah. All Somebody in, fell in love. All in love yeah. with Strahd and. No, I did not. I did not. You fail it one more time, and it's can't. You, you fail it one more time, and I'm making it a permanent I character flaw. Wanna, is all I'm I saying. <laughs> <laughs> it's yes, all I'm saying. Okay. It's okay. you fail it. You fail it third times a char. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> so for context, like two sessions ago, I was charmed by mm -hmm. uh, Daru, which is another vampire. <laughs> Yay me! And then I was charmed by Strahd. <laughs> Yay me! And then Dread said that if I get charmed by a third time, it's like he said, it'll be. It's canon. Bad. She's got a. She's got a thing. She, she got a thing for uh, that sparkly skin. You know the the skin of a killer. It's gonna be <laughs> awesome because I can just try to charm her nonstop until it becomes a character flaw. You're an asshole if you do that. This is amazing. Oh my god. 
I can just charm <laughs> What's you every up? day. This is perfect. Orange, just wake orange. up and be like, good morning, Arashi. Orange. I got a question for you. I know you've watched Twilight. What, what's, what's, the, what's the woman's name for Twilight? Bella. Which one? Yeah. Ar Arashi, Arashi's new name is going to be Bella here, here shortly. I know it's going to happen. I Just all kinds of... Arashi, you had a chance there. You had a chance there to not call it out Bella. You could have said which one. <laughs> which one? No, yep. she, not... she knew. She knew. She's all about he, it. He, She's he all about it. He could have looked it up himself, bro. He could have looked it up himself. Which one? <laughs> Jessica? <laughs> I didn't know there was more than one woman in Twilight. Edward has so many like sisters, and oh, then there's like fantastic. I used to love Twilight when I was younger. Okay, we'll talk later. I, anyway, I can tell. It's, it's, very it's fantastic. fantastic. All right, Listen makes sense why past. she likes like makes sense why she likes vampires. Yeah, All right, true. I said I was a werewolf. Bro. All right, anyway, moving on. Well, so charm these fucking things. <laughs> Animal handling it up. Go for it. Animal handling checks. This is the way that it works. Right. Uh, I'm going <laughs> to roll my right. NPCs. Uh, yeah. That's, they uh, rolled low, except for that guy. You, um, you want us to roll for initiative? Uh, I will let you guys all roll for initiative. Yes. Uh, including our, uh, our newest member, which we will get to uh, now, actually. Now would be a good time as you guys are all rolling your dice. Uh, so, uh, as, as everybody can see, we do in fact have a, have a new player joining us, taking, uh, Whoop. taking the spot, uh, our, our fifth slot here, uh, Wizzo, if you would like to, uh, introduce yourself. I am Wizzo Aitons, uh, practically everywhere. Um, I'm, sometimes I stream, I uh, haven't lately because of, uh, health issues, but, uh, I'm going to get back into it. All right. right on. Welcome, welcome. Right off the bat, we're gonna be welcome. we're gonna be having Wiz do all kinds of things. Right. Fuck some shit up. We're gonna we're gonna see him fuck some shit up. As coming uh, hot. That's all we, I gotta say. He's he's he is in fact actually coming in hot. Whereas RJ let people sneak up on you, right? Uh, as uh, you know, he's he didn't do so. Uh, he didn't do terrible on the roll, but he didn't do excellent on the roll. Uh, they they got a little yeah. bit closer, and uh, you know we we had certain other NPCs fall asleep on watch, right? Irina, yeah, not ones fell asleep on watch. Literally uh, the only thing I told her not to do. Literally the only thing. Well, she was bored. She's a noble. All right, she's a noble. She's not used to you know having to deal with this shit. Right? She want to fucking die. Yeah, well, this is how you die. You know, no, nobody's been attacking her. She got attacked once ever since you guys left. And it was by a mindless twig, basically. And she did kill it, to say the least. Very now, twig. as... Now we, burnt, we pulled it out of her and burned it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I remember that. You guys, you guys did, in fact. Mm -hmm. So. All right. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Trying to find... There it is. What the fuck was that? This shit scared me. Is that cutting in and out for anybody else? Yes. Yes, it is. Sounds very staticky. Yeah. Why is my dog barking? One second. Let me get this set up and see if it actually fixes it. I'm sorry. I fixed it for me. Is it fixed it for you? Fix it for you? Yep. Sounds better, yeah. It's not as choppy. Jesus. It's just growling and anger. Well, I mean, you guys are sitting here staring at uh, at werewolves uh, coming in uh, closer and closer. As we do, however, Wiz, if you would like to uh, introduce your character as uh, I, he, he had multiple options on what to do as he came in. He gets one free round that none of you do. gonna um means i can't see what i was tracking um and there's way too many shadows for the number of people in the camp um 
move myself there. A hole in the camp. You know you have uninvited guests outside your light, don't you? I think you would have. Yes. Uh, yeah, I think you would have. I think you would have heard earlier as uh, last session, Kane, uh, the one in the upper left hand corner, decided to uh, scream, "Wake up!" Because he he saw him. Yeah. Yeah, who are you? Uh, I am Zarwinet. Uh, wizard. Nosy, busybody. Uh, at least that's what some people have called me. Um, and uh, woke up in these woods. And. Um, we will have conversations later. You're not gonna have much time for a conversation, <laughs> otherwise I'm gonna I'm gonna rush over and basically get you ass bit. Are these are these your dogs? Nope. Okay. Uh well uh do some wizard shit. We need to kill these things. <laughs> Uh, why, why, why are they moving closer? They, they, they're, they're moving closer because there was some conversation to be had, and they're not waiting for that shit. So, uh, Wiz, you get an action, buddy, <laughs> to, to start you off, and then I'm going to have you roll for initiative. Uh, I thought he did already. Yeah, he did. It was yeah, he rolled. Tree, but it's not, it's not showing on it didn't pop the sound tree. It didn't populate. Click your, click your character. It, it shows in a... It yeah, shows in yeah, found he probably rolled... He, I don't know if he was selected for his uh, token. I will move your thing. I will update your character sheet. Uh, while while I am updating, I, I'm moving okay. it. Calm down. Calm, no, slow no, your no, 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 no. I'm sorry. I just want to make sure he, he, was, he had his role. I'm, I'm, I'm updating the stuff. I didn't feel like that. I didn't In the meantime, <laughs> Wiz, what action do you want to take? Is there anyone who is? So first off, how about you guys explain to him what he sees for you, and then we'll go the other way. Just so Fair. we're gonna we're gonna start in the upper left hand corner. Kane. Kane, uh, Ranger, um, kind of. I don't remember how I introduced myself before. <laughs> I, you don't have to do the, the full introductions. Just explain to him what he sees. Uh, see a guy... Uh, uh, rapier, dagger, longbow, heavy crossbow... Wearing scale mail armor and uh, yeah, ready to go. I'll uh, I'll set I'll set you off next, as there is a beautiful red-haired uh, young woman, basically still. She is actually in armor, all right, carrying a rather large great sword, no shield, no nothing. Uh, definitely carries herself with a with an air of confidence. Now, whether or not that's deserved or not is yet to be seen, but she is uh, very much so carries herself in in, in high regard and uh, high esteem, even in the uh, in the woods and whatnot. You know, definitely uh, very well put together, or it seems to be that way. Standing next to Arashi, go ahead, Arashi. Um. Honestly, you'd probably see the back of Arashi, to be honest, because she's more focused on the werewolves, or I don't know if she knows what they are, but she, like surrounded by the werewolves, and she's trying to protect Irina. So she has, like, on, like, her left hand is her shield, and then her right, you see the sword. Um, long black hair, very, looks like a paladin, is a paladin. Um, <laughs> and I think that's all you'd see from her, to be honest. Um, yeah. Am I supposed to say no? semi -O, down in the right-hand corner. Mm, you see a guy in a brown cloak with a hood on. <laughs> and a hockey mask. And a hockey mask, yeah. <laughs> okay. 
He's uh, he's it. basically That's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the uh, the dude with the uh... Casey <laughs> Jones. Yeah. All right, Kami. And then Kami completely covered in black. Oh, what's up? That's exactly who I was thinking of. <laughs> um, Kami is completely in black. Like you can't really see anything. Like he wears a mask covering the bottom portion of his face. Um, but he is a human, uh, with two large swords on his back, uh, and you can kind of see around his waist a bunch of, like, weird-looking knives. Um, kind of guy who's looking to slip away, uh, and hide, but knows his way around blades. And that's good. All right, so they've shown you what you see i'm just gonna call your character x <laughs> all right x what do what is it that they see as far as what you look like uh they see a humanoid um uh, right around six feet tall um with sapphire like skin and yes it does sparkle like a gem um where the skin of a killer Oh, mm -hmm. and uh, my right hand seems to be a tad machine. Mm. Just a mm. just a tad. Uh, as I will ask for a perception check, probably at disadvantage from from the four of you. Yeah. <laughs> it didn't matter either way. Ooh. I don't yeah. see anything. <laughs> I don't either. Oh, damn. Kane, bro, you are a terrible watchman. Like, when I say terrible, I mean terrible, bro. <laughs> um, but Kami and Semio, uh, not quite enough to tell at this distance. But the rest of his skin, right, definitely sparkles. Uh, his, his right hand? Right hand, right? You got that right? Right? His right hand does not. And Marvel. looks a little different. And we'll I'm leave it at that. I'm just going to kind of look over my shoulder at Sam and be like, is this motherfucker glowing? Looks like he's got a real strong hand. <laughs> He'd take my strong hand. <laughs> All right. He's a fucking disco ball. All Let's right, go. X. Show, show, show him what you can do is you have one action to take. You can do. You can choose any of the three that you would like to choose from. Three. Right. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Now I uh, I let him know <laughs> that he realistically had three options to choose from as he came running in. Um. I guess Yolo. Uh. <laughs> You've already moved your thirty feet. Yeah. Um. I don't think I can quite throw the item that far. If you want to throw that item, I will let you throw that item. You kind of, you kind of ran up thirty feet. I'll just let it happen. It doesn't weigh much. Okay. Well, yeah, you, you wound up, it up while you're running. Here, somebody take this. You can use it better than I can, and you'll see a. Uh, I throw a uh, short sword into the air, and it. A little shinier than normal. Who's grasping at it? Kane, it's I mean, probably I'm going to you at... first, buddy. Yeah, I, I'm not looking. Yeah, if it's, if it's coming to me, I'll see if I can't catch that thing by the handle. All right. Let's see if you can have I'm a better roll than your nat off. one, bro. Uh, yep. We're uh, we're slight of handing this. He's going to get impaled. Let's, 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 try not to, let's try not to get your hand cut. Like the finger off. Fifteen. Nice. You catch it. Good job. Good job. All right. Do the heavens sing as he? It does oh. not. But as he looks at it, it is definitely uh, it is definitely a lot shinier than uh, your current sword, sword buddy. As you have a silvered sword, sword. All right. 
Well, silver. Looks a looks a little bit better. And silver. Almost Inside like D &D, uh, it's, it's it's what you're supposed to have to fight these things. Inside of D&D, &D, no idea what it's going to do. Inside of D&D, &D, you guys do not, but uh, there is a certain oh, player on this uh, on this field who does actually know what this is going to do, as I let him uh, let him know that his character knows. So it's not just that he can do it better. <laughs> but he can do it better. <laughs> I am not finding silver short sword on the inventory list. Uh, yeah, just add, just silver add silver short it. sword, uh, and then yeah, and then you'll basically, basically there's a toggle for it. Yeah, there's a there's a toggle for it. All right, all right. So he has thrown this. We will. Uh, you know what? I'll take the I'll take that throwing as a bonus action. Take your action. You're gonna need it. Okay. Um. Thanks. <laughs> that was bad. I am going to throw an acid splash at this guy in okay. the upper yep. left. Go ahead. Roll your dice. Let's see what you got. Actually, he's got to make the uh, Dex 13 save. Dex 13 save? All right. 11, he will fail. Takes five points of damage. Five um, points of acid damage. Melt his ass down. And that'll be my. Should be my turn. Alright. He's, uh. He's gonna retaliate, buddy. As, uh, we will start the actual initiative orders. Let's we'll see what you guys can actually do here. As he will run up. And, uh, he's going to try to bite at you. For a 16 to hit. Unfortunately. You will take nine points of piercing damage as it sinks into your shoulder. I also need a DC 12 con saving throw, please. Jesus. Good to go. As you're standing next yeah. to him, we will move to your turn. Oh. X. I think you're muted. You may be muted, X. Hey, is that any better? Yep, I can hear you now. Yep. Uh, he needs to make another dexterity saving throw of 13. All right. Eight. Nice. Nope. Okay, then he's going to take eight points of damage this round, and I did, it was Tasha's um, caustic brew. Yep. And so uh, until he either washes it off or wipes it off, he's going to take 2d4. Let me make sure I'm saying this right. Yep. I believe it was 2d4 acid damage at the start of each of his turns. Turn. Yep. Okay. All right. Nice. Right. Anything else Great you would like to one. do for this turn? Um, with him, hopefully, I'll do a disengage step and go five feet back. So disengage is an action. 
Okay. Then I can't do that. Uh, then... Um... I'm gonna take off for, uh... The light. Try and get to there. Alright. Yeah. As as you try to take off, he's gonna try to he's gonna try to swipe at you with the claws as you will take an attack of opportunity. And he's gonna nail you for another seven points of slashing damage. Alright. Technically you have a bonus action if you want a bonus action. Um I can't think of anything right now. All right, then we'll move over to Arashi. Arashi. Okay, Arashi's gonna move up here and then cast Bane um, on these three, this one, this one, and this one. All right, up to three creatures of your choice with you make charisma saving throws. Mm -hmm. What's the DC for you? DC is 13? 13. All right, charisma saving throw. Uh, you said for which three? Uh, all but the bottom left. All but the bottom left. All right, we're gonna go top, top first, saving throw. To the left, saving throw, and at the bottom, saving throw. Let's go. All four Let's will go. fail. Okay, here I'm just gonna put it in the chat. I was looking at doing that as well. Just Bane them all? <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, Bane is... You're... Oh, wait. How do I put it in the chat with uh, the actual, like... I got it. Okay, you got it. You. you already put it in. Perfect. Uh, I'm just going to label them as weakened, because I feel like that's going to be our best bet to, to remember that. So. Oh, it was already in there. Oh, I didn't realize that. Okay. But... No, I'm, I'm marking yeah. the tokens for you. Thank you. Um... Yeah, then after that, I'm gonna... Arashi's gonna look at Irina and say, Stay behind me. We don't know what these are and how powerful they can be. And then, um, I'm just gonna scream to the rest of the team. Like... Uh... Shit, man. I don't know what the fuck we got ourselves into this time. But they look pretty strong. Yeah, let, let, let's let's try our best not to die today, okay? And that, that's that's what she... right. That's end my turn. Sorry. Uh... The fuck? It's the wolfy howl. It is a wolfy howl. <laughs> As this one begins to start to come a little closer, it does come closer, but it stops, and it's looking at one of you. And it just starts pacing back and forth. Back and forth. Not moving any closer. Kami, it's staring at you. Uh, do I know why? I do not. But it is definitely sniffing back and <laughs> sniff. And kind of like a dog who is wanting to pounce but it's getting a little nervous back and forth just paces and that'll be the end of its turn as we move over to Samael as it's just pacing staring at you mm. how are you looking X a little half yeah not, not looking so hot mm. holy vey yeah I'm gonna go ahead and heal you as I reach out <laughs> and touch your shoulder <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Have some HP. Cool. 12 points of HP comes flooding back into your system. And then that will be my turn. Points back. Oh, you added 12 points as well. Here, I'll move it back. God damn it. That's my turn. That's the health you're supposed to be at. Jeez, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> it just did not want to do it. All right, that is the that is the turn for you. 
as this one's going to come rushing in. Okay. Starting with a bite right on you, Arashi. Does not hit. Does not hit. Nothing as it does, as it's you. trying to get in. I need you to make a either an athletics check or an acrobatics check. Arashi. I'll go to athletics. It will do okay. athletics as well. DC is 17 for you. 21, baby. 21. As you see this thing trying to grab a hold of you, not attacking, but legitimately showing some kind of intelligence as it's trying to get a hold of you and trying to get move past you. Move past me? Yep. Mm. Trying to get to somebody. Um... Oh. As from okay. where you have seen, the same thing is happening with an athletics check of 18. Coming back, Irina. Come on, Irina. Ooh. Is in a struggle. I'm going to reroll it again. Got this in the bag. She is, she is, in fact, able to break out of it Bless as it tries to take its turn, unable to grab a hold. It is trying to grab a hold of Arena. As we move to Kane. Wait. All right. Oh, you're good. I was about to say so, it's Bane, uh, isn't it? Yeah, but it didn't matter. It did, I was yeah. gonna say it. Yeah, I was gonna say it if she. It took both it. of its. It took both of its. It took both of its actions to be able to do so. Our both turns stress trying to grab a hold of it. All right, so I've got Still that uh, silver short sword in my hand, and I'm gonna toss it over to Kami and go, catch man, and then pull up my bow, and uh, wait before I shoot Hunter's mark, uh, this one. Perfect. There we go. Copy. I'm gonna need a uh, a sleight of hand from you, buddy. Just on that one. DC's pretty I low. Didn't. You didn't that didn't. one. You didn't that one. I have a plus six. Thank you goodness. stumbled for a second. <laughs> Without that plus six, he would have dropped it. <laughs> but I'll give it to you. All right, you pull out the bow. All right, I'm taking a shot at the guy. At right, the guy on the left. Yep. Okay, go ahead. 24. 24 definitely hits. I don't believe he was injured yet, so... Uh, he was, in yeah, fact, yes. injured. Yes, he, yeah, was. he was. Oh, yes, did it roll my Colossus Slayer? It did not. Uh, it did not roll your Colossus. Huh. What's the extra damage for Colossus? 1d8. Alright, roll me an extra d8. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Alright, 19. Alright. Give me a perception check. As you sink this arrow directly towards him. Buried that arrow in him. Kane, even with that 10, you're focused. You reel back the arrow. You let it fly. You hit dead center mass. You know for a fact that point hit. But it does not bury in him. It slides. It hits. And yeah, it draws a little bit of blood. But it's not as much as you might think. Seems these guys may be a little tougher. As he will only take half the damage that you had intended. Oh, I'm gonna have to use the bigger bow. <laughs> Anything else you want to do this turn? Well, technically, uh, no. you got your bonus action and your action through. I you already used so Hunter's choose. mark, um, so I don't have my bonus action. I'm guessing but, uh, you're kind of you're doing. Uh, yeah, I cast it on him. So I'm casting it on him? Alright. Yeah. 
Normally I would have gave it to you, but you casted it after. No, he already did it. He I said it before. before. He said it before. It just <laughs> didn't want to do it. I'll tell you oh, what, that was supposed to be a th three points of damage for that. I'll give you an extra. I'll give you an extra. Ding. All right. Yeah. As this goes through, Arena just turns around. Get your hands off of me! As he will announce to all of you a command for all of you. That she can see within 30 feet, which is all of you. You will have creature adds a d4 to your next d20 roll. As she will use, as she will use her leadership ability. And then she will turn, looking directly at this werewolf, and she will swing that giant sword of hers. Hitting max damage. And for the first time, you see true blood. As the light catches, and you notice her sword is also silvered. Okay. Hmm. We'll take all 14 points of damage. That will be the end of her turn. Kami. I'm just gonna look at this shiny sword and be like, fuck, that is bright. Uh, we gotta protect Irina, guys. And since this one tried to scuffle with her, I'm going to attempt to, like, jump on him and stab him with my new silvered short sword. All right. Swing away, my friend. 15 to hit. 15 will hit. And he will get that snack attack on him, too. So 12 damage. Well, in fact, and he will take all 12 <laughs> points of that damage. And he's going to look over at everybody and be like, these guys are a little bitey, huh? We know what that means. And I'm going to try to bite him. <laughs> all right, go ahead. Right in front of Arena. <laughs> right in front of Arena. I'm going to bite this motherfucker. Right in front of Arena. Goes for the bite attack. Uh, so that's 14 plus 4, so 18 to hit. 18 hits. And that's going to be uh, D4 plus 4. Yeah. 6 damage, necrotic. 6 damage. And then he needs to make a constitution saving throw. Constitution saving which throw. Which is DC 14. Oh, wow. 14 it is. He's baned. Ah, he, he is, is baned. in fact bane, which means he fails. So he's going to take 2d6 more necrotic damage. Go for it. Nice. Eight more necrotic damage. Extra eight. And I'm going to get a fury point from that. And I don't need any of the heels, so I'll just, you know, take a big old chunk out of his shoulder. All right, as you as you do, unlike the just terrible taste that you had in your mouth uh, from the from the zombies, this one it burns in your mouth a little bit. You can feel it trying to accomplish something, but given your current state. You don't have to make any rolls, but it burns, man. That fucking it's 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 like eating spicy salsa, bro. It's the first time you've had any real sensation from taste. It's fiesta time, boys. It's fiesta time. <laughs> All right, where's the chips? As we will move right past, and I'll be right back. He takes two d four damage at the start of his turn. Yep. All right, go ahead and roll me two d four. Four points of a damage. As this thing takes four points of damage. It's seemingly not interested in you as as it kind of shakes 
It shakes, it burns a little bit. But it moves right past you, X. Kane, it's moving past you as well. Seemingly uninterested for no apparent reason. Shaking its head. It begins to howl as it runs past you. As Arashi, yet again, needs you to make me an athletics check. DC 13. Uh, I'm not going to jinx it, never mind. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're Gucci. We're, we're great. Gucci? Yep, 21. One last time as the other claw comes in. I need you to make a second athletics check. This DC well, is 21. Okay, it gets minus four, right? Or does it not on this one? Uh, this one does, it in fact, matter. get a minus four. It didn't matter. Doesn't it matter. Doesn't matn matter. Doesn't matter. matter. Doesn't matter. As, as it comes in, it's trying to push you out of the way. As it's burning, it's just moving its head back and forth. It just can't seem to do what it wants. X. Um, I'm going to let everybody know, these are werewolves. They're uh, weakened to silver weapon. If you have anything silver, stab them with it. Even forks. Um, and with that... You can probably breathe lightning on this motherfuckers. They're lined up for you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? They are. So, uh, yeah, we're going to do a thunder we breath weapon. Dope. Go they for both it. need to make a DC uh, 13 deck save, please. DC 13 deck save. As the first one comes in, this one closest will pass. The one Without behind Bane. it. Both of them have Bane. Both of them have Banes. First one will fail. I need you to roll me a D4. Pray you don't get a one. All you need is two. I believe. Let's go. I believe. There you go. Both of them will fail. That Bane coming in clutch. They're going to take... Nice. Takes max damage. Look at you go. All right. The werewolf directly in front of you howls out in pain as you see blood start to seep out. As it is now officially bleeding. Anything else you would like to do for this turn? Nope. All right. Then we move to Arashi. Alright, after that other werewolf tried to get on her, she, like, uses her shield to push him off. Get the fuck off of me. Jesus. Y'all smell like dog, man. And then she's gonna, uh, take a swing at the, mm, she's trying to decide. At this one, though. At the one that first attacked her, or tried to. The one to the north, got it. To. Yes. Go so, for it. Uh, That is the plus one. I can't even Orange. add anything to that. I, uh, Get your shit together. Listen, listen, I just, I literally just wrote it in and I wrote it. Listen. Oh, oh whoops. I didn't mean to read I need that. you to roll me. Huh. I need you to roll me a d4. Kane, odds or evens? Even. Even it is. Kane, as she swings around trying to hit this thing wildly, she comes around her longsword moving too long, too far. I need you to roll me damage, Arashi. We're doing more damage to ourselves than the werewolves are. Mm -hmm. Ouch. Mm -hmm. Holy shit. Of course she yeah. critted it. Yeah, she did. Uh, as Kane, oh, oh, um, watch it. Wow. 
as you will take 10 points of damage as it comes around, nailing you. Arashi, oh, is there anything else that you would like to do as you've, uh, you've slashed Kane? That's all she just. She just. I'm so sorry. I don't know what happened to me. A thought. A thought occurs on the back of your mind, Kane. I bet you, if you were a vampire, that wouldn't have happened. Damn, son. I was just yeah. thinking I was gonna try to charm her on this turn. <laughs> Only hit dogs. <laughs> Only hit the puppies. Oh, no. No. <laughs> Listen, Arashi, do you want to do anything yeah. with your bonus action? No, no I, I, I don't think there's anything I can. Do. I would actually, no, wait, I can. Um, hold on, heal him. My lay on hands, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna touch. Where did I cut you, dude? No, no, don't worry <laughs> about it. I still had oh, temp HP. Oh, we still have temp. Oh, uh, no. the temp HP should have went away when uh, you long rested, technically. Not yet. No, no, no. no. Twenty four no, hours. It was twenty four oh, hours. Twenty four hours. Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah it wasn't a long rest. It was thirteen. Gotcha. Thank you. Great to know. It really um, wasn't temp HP. It was added yeah, to your max. Yeah, it increased it increased your max by thirteen. Gotcha. Okay. All right. I'm so sorry. That's it. <laughs> All right. And then that's uh. If you're not laying lay on hands, then it'll be the uh, the werewolf's turn. As again, it's gonna move up closer, and as it does, Kami begins to take a swipe, sniffs again, and you just hear Whoop! as it will actually leap across. And yes, both of you can take this attack of opportunity if you so choose. Oh, I'm hitting the fuck out of it. <laughs> Go ahead. I have to use the I have to use the weapon, right? I can't use it spell. Mm, uh so yes. You have to use a weapon or whatever you're carrying. Mine's a nineteen to hit. Alright, it will hit. And it's a silver it blade. No sneak attack, so nine damage. Nine damage. Nine damage, sir. All right. Silvered. Very much so we'll take that damage. Samael hits as well. Cracking it on. Obviously, I, we don't have to go through the rolls. You already know at this point. It doesn't do as much damage as you think it would. Kind of bounces off a little bit. As it gets to the other side. Arena begins to fight as being surrounded. He will do this with advantage. Irina will not. Nice. She's still able to do it. Grabs on with the other. That a girl. That they a girl. Cannot seem to grab a hold. But it seems that they are. Leaving each of you alone, they're only interested in one person. Oh. This guy's the one that's worst damaged, right? Yes. That is the one that's uh, bleeding right now. You will see Samuel snap his fingers again as he needs to make a dexterity saving throw, DC 15. Dex saving throw. Let's see if I can actually do damage, boys. Will fail. Doesn't even need the bane. Four points of radiant damage. Four points of radiant damage. It does, in fact, hurt. And then that will be my turn. All right, as we come back around. Unable to push you out of the way, but knowing others are, in fact, able to get to Arena, we'll actually begin to start fighting. Let's go. Twenty-two to hit. Okay. If 
I can get it to my, if I can get, yeah, yeah, if I can lose four, I win. I win this. Go ahead. Then win it. Three still hits. Still, have a... it still hits. Still hits. As you will take ten points of piercing damage. I will need a con saving throw from you, please. Okay. Um, do you want me to take it off or are you taking it off? Uh, I'm, I'll take it off for you. Very good, very nice. As claws come in afterwards, you feel it sink into you, and then you just feel it reach up to go to take a strike. Nothing there. Glances off of your armor. Is this one worried about Kami? Just... It will take one attack against you, Kami, and will not try to bite you. It's trying to swipe you away. 13 to hit. Nope. Does not hit. Turns. I'm going to boop him on his snoot and say, bad boy. <laughs> Turns. And we'll try to grab. For I nat my 20. Reaction to give I want to use my reaction to try to give her advantage by grabbing her and pulling her. If I can. Roll me D100. You got a 50 50 shot. High or low? High. Roll me That's D100. Good. I believe. Oh, Let's that's go. high. I will give that's it to you. High. She will Let's try. We, you will try to get this with advantage. Yeah. Unfortunately, oh. it does not matter. It did not go well. She is being held right now. Which wolf has her? The, the one, one next closest to, me. to you, Kami. As it does. Uh, I need to find out just how far. We'll begin to pull Irina. You do get your attack of opportunity. As she is struggling as this thing is pulling her and ripping her across. Um, can I use a fury point? Uh, it doesn't say it's a bonus action or anything. It just says when I hit with a melee weapon attack. Yeah, I want to ask because it is reactive. I'll give it okay. to you. Um, I'm going to make it a calculated strike. It doesn't do much. It just does extra damage. We got you. That'll hit. Nice. It will, in fact, hit. Plus another D6. So 12 damage. 12 damage. It definitely hurts. It is bleeding profusely as it comes out, but he's still getting her away. As you've taken this, he's trying to start running. It's not quite happening. Kane comes to you as you hear Arena start screaming. Get your filthy paws off of me! All right. Um, I'm going to swap to the heavy crossbow and move my hunter's mark to that one. And, uh, right. I'm going to see if I can't put a stop to this. I know it's going to be at disadvantage, so. Moving the hunter's mark over. Oh, uh, no. Ken's not going to do it. Uh, you're, you got a 23, buddy. It's, I've got a you guy were... within five feet. Oh, you hit it at disadvantage. Got it. Ten will not do it. You are correct. Um. Anything yeah, else? Yeah, that's... Now that's it. That's it. Irina trying to pull free... Does come free. And with her attack, swing that greatsword. 
Let's go. And lob the head right off. Let's go. Of our Let's go. Let's go. Kami. I'm going to run up in between that one and her. And I don't know if he'll let this, but I'm going to try to cut his fucking leg off. <laughs> All right. All right. We're going to see what you get. Let's see what you get. Well, you're not cutting any legs off today, but you did hit it. <laughs> Second attack. This is a regular katana. Yeah. Roll your damage for the huh? first one, if you would, please. Oh, okay. That that hit. Yeah, thirteen did hit. Yep. Oh, nice. Eighteen damage. Uh, it is the full damage. Eighteen damage. Does in fact take it. The eleven misses though, right? Well, it would be a nine actually. Nine. Nine will miss. Yeah, minus the proficiency. Nine um, will miss. And I'm going to try to go num num on him. I num num him. Num num. <laughs> num 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 num. Definitely hits. Uh, that is five damage and then a constitution saving throw, DC 14. Constitution saving throw, DC 14. I'm saving throw coming in. We'll pass uh, it. He's still baned, isn't he? Uh, was this bad. was not baned. This is the only oh, one that's God not baned. Oh, damn it. Oh. Yeah, that's the only one well, that's baned. Then that's it. Right. I took a nibble, but I don't get anything. Oh, yeah, the one that... Okay, so this, just to make sure, so I remember, this is the only one... Not Yes, right. that is the only one not being. I, I put the I put the I put the weakened uh, yeah, trait yeah, yeah, up yeah. on the upper left hand corner for those that you had banged. Thank you. I remember. Standing against this, Kane been trying to hit. Zars trying to hit. Everybody trying to hit. Hold on. Yes, that is true. We'll take that five points of damage. Still bleeding out. Trying to do what it can, can't do anything. Looks over, looks over, looks over. Czar, you've heard it by far the most. And as such, for a crit. Oof. That will be, uh, what is that for the first one? Five plus two, seven plus another eight. That's 15 points of damage. Coming your way, Zar. Oh, you stinking mutt. I need a con saving throw, please. Looking good. As it tries to get into you. Sinking its teeth in. Cool. Swipe out its other arm right at you, Kane. Unable to find purchase. Axe, you're not looking so hot, but you've come to save these people. Yeah. Before you do, I need a perception check from you. Alrighty. All right, the heat of combat is strong. All right. Um... Uh, if I do that. Now I'm going to hit them, so I can't use that one. Um... What you got, Liz? Um, I was going to think about doing a Thunder Wave, but 15 foot cube. I'm going to hit uh, everybody around me. Mm-hmm. I mean, I can't even think of a way of 
being these two yuckleheads, um, I should say chuckleheads, um, because I'm gonna, I'd get, uh, Arashi too. Because with, you know, with, with yep. it being a cube. Yep. Um, you know what? It seemed like a pretty good thing the last time. Okay, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Aha, there it is. Oh, uh, they need to make another, uh, DC uh, 13 deck save. I'm going to breathe once again. As you use your second breath weapon. What's the cons or what's the uh, dex amount? Thir 13 dex. 13? First one will fail. Second one will fail as well. As I am rolling super low tonight. Right. They take two points of damage. All right. Two points of damage. Right. Anything else you would like to do for this turn? Um. No. Very well. Arashi. Well, I need a perception check and disadvantage from you, please. Okay. Nine. You're surrounded. What do you got? You're surrounded. You're surrounded. Ah. Ah. All right, I'm going after... This is the one that's been hit the most, right? It is the one bleeding the most right now, yes. Actually, I'm going to go after this one because this one has a, uh, didn't take its turn yet. <laughs> All right, go ahead. <laughs> 18. Hey. 18 will hit. Yay. Much better than that nat one. Yeah, I know. Fuck him up, see bets. Didn't get stabbed. Five points of damage. <laughs> Throw some smites in there. Oh, As... my God, I forgot. Mm, too late. Too late. Right? You got it. Are you going to put a smite on it? Yeah. Go ahead and put a smite on it. <laughs> I'll allow it this time. Just remember, next time. Yeah. Say it beforehand. I forget about it. Sorry. Okay. Um... Nice. Look at that. There you go. <laughs> Thanks, Kong. As... Uh... Let me take a spell slot before I forget. Do some of that god shit. As you uh, as you start to shit. as you hit, your sword stops a hell of a lot faster than what you would normally think. You're like, what the hell? And you just scream out in rage and let your divine energy flow as it sinks in. It will take that extra damage from your divine smite. But that long sword stopped and didn't do as much damage by itself as you had thought. Anything else you would like to do for this turn? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna lay on hands because I still feel bad. So I'm gonna yeah. put my hands on Kane, heal him for the ten I hit him for. <laughs> All right. All right. And that's it. Healing, healing him for the ten. Uh, did you put that in, Kane? Yep, put it in now. There Doing it right now. Got it. Perfect. All right. As this one goes in, it's going to kind of walk back and forth for a second. Kane, it's going to look at you. You done piss it off at this point. Kane or Kami? Kami, sorry. Okay, you're good. Nope. It's going to snap at you, unable to find purchase. That one will, though. Not being able to hit. Wait, build up the minus four. Still? It's not baned. He's not baned. Not baned oh, yeah. I keep forgetting. Sorry. Okay, my bad. Every time. Just can you will feel this thing rake across your chest. Oh, back at you, motherfucker. Samuel. 
Uh, I'm gonna reach Perception out. Perception check, please. Touch. Disadvantage. Uh, Before you do. You can you can do it. Yep. Disadvantage. Perception check with disadvantage, please. The heat of battle is strong, bro. All right, do what you want. I was gonna reach out and touch uh, Z or X on the shoulder. Reach out Give and touch some help. me. Go for it. Twenty oh, points of healing. That's the big boy's heals. Mm -hmm. As you see, every single wound that X had had just close up, with the exception of one. His hand still looking pretty well, gnarly. Well, uh, as I do, I'll be like, uh, try not to get hit anymore. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hit them, not yourself. <laughs> He's a dick like that. Don't worry about it. You're doing great. He's not wrong. <laughs> I am an asshole, but, you know, whatever. Arashi. Well, mm -hmm. There's this one standing in front. Is there anything else you wanted to do, though? You said that was your turn, right? I did. Yeah, I did. Yeah. As this one is, as you had hit this one, it takes one final look at you, shakes its head again. You can take an attack of opportunity as of it runs course. away from you. Coward! Shank it. Shank the fuck out of it. That's hitting. I was so close when that's one. Definitely hits. Oh, oh. So close. So it will take Seven. four points of damage. No. From your non-silvered sword. I still call the coward. Runs over Kami. Mm -hmm. Standing directly in between you two will reap out of his claws at you as it runs yeah, in. Mm -hmm. For 20 to hit. He's, ba he's Bane. Right, he needs to roll a d4 uh, first. It'll hit no matter what. Yeah. Okay. Damn. As it's able to find purchase, it wraps around you, having lunge at you claws in, comes around you. It's going to try to sink its teeth into you in one swift motion. Unable nope. to as you're able to get around. And I'm going to boop him on his snoot and say bad. Kane, <laughs> I need a perception check at disadvantage from you as well. Mm -hmm. one night. Kane... Nothing. Unable to see it. Go ahead and take your turn, bud. All right. Um, I'm going to move my hunter's mark back to this guy. Uh, stow the heavy crossbow on my side and pull out my rapier. And, uh, stab that guy. <laughs> stab away. In the old poke. Twenty-one. Twenty-one definitely hits. Nice. Let's go, Kane. Thirteen. Thirteen. Uh, you also get Colossus Slayer, right? Yeah, why isn't it rolling that? It might only be... Do you have Colossus Slayer already? Weapon. Yes. It, it might Colossus be Slayer. defaulting to your top weapon. So it might be the one crossbow. Let me see. One D8 plus four no that's yeah, it's that's... a d8 go ahead and roll me another d8 because you do have classic okay. slayer yeah. yeah it's only one all right well hey, you know every li every little bit every little bit counts except in this case yeah. where it's half so <laughs> you would have gotten it either way uh 14 this thing is on its last legs as your rapier hits in goes in just Kind of gets stuck just right before you can feel it. You know it's right there, but just can't find the last little bee's dick worth of health that it has. Anything else you would like to do for your turn? 
A call out to Irina. Circle back around to us. They're all coming after you. And uh, that'll be the end of my turn. As it says... <laughs> Just barely not enough. As you see flying out of nowhere. Swooping down. And picking Irina up. With the bottom of his claws. You just see black wings. As Irina is lifted 30 feet into the air almost instantaneously. Having basically dive bomb below. You see what X had been tracking. It seems that it was coming for you the entire coming for Arena the entire time. As together they start moving down they start moving away from each and every one of you. Thirty feet in the air. Kami. Not today, Isis. I'm gonna move up. I'll take the attack of opportunity from the one. It will, in fact. As the claws come out. Unable to find purchase. I'm gonna vampiric mist. And misty step 30 feet in the air. Alright. And I'm gonna swing on this fucker's leg that's got her. I like where your head's at. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what you got. 16 to hit. 16 will hit. I will damage. even give you your sneak attack damage. You feel this, you, you see this thing kind of pull yank down as it does. Doesn't finish it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right. Um, so you guys are gonna see Kami just fucking dead sprint away, and then this huge black mist of smoke surrounds him, and you just see him appear in midair as he swings the sword, just cuts its fucking bottom half off as it falls. I didn't say. Board. I said, does it Damn finish it? it. <laughs> oh, fine. Oh, we thought you said does. No, I thought does I not he, he finish that it. Fucker. <laughs> right. Not with it's only sixteen still... health, bro. <laughs> That's why I was laughing. I was like, Yeah, I was like, oh, this is squishy as fuck. <laughs> All right. Um, how's its leg? Like, did I take a good chunk out of it? Uh, you've definitely hit it pretty pretty hard. I'm gonna bite it. I will give I'm you your second I, I will give you your second attack, not the bite. Okay. Because you are pretty much free falling at this point. <laughs> yeah, you know, swing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just kind of picture you just like coming up and just like both both That's sorts fair. like. That's fair. Natural twenty. Let's go. Nice. Very nice. Roll me damage and hope you get it there, bro. You're so close. Nine. Uh, nine. But this is the one. This is the katana, non-silvered. Yeah. With the crit, though. Mm -hmm. It is with the crit. It's doubled. Yeah. It is with the crit. Mm -hmm. Uh, what is that? A D6 extra? Six plus That's nine. 15. Yeah. 15 divided by two. Seven and a half. Seven so half. eight points worth of damage. Bro, if you would have had a silvered weapon, you would have had it. Damn. I need you to roll me three D6s as you plummet oh, back like down to the, the ground. Earth. As you yeah, fall to the earth. Shot. Eight. Okay. Eight. You will take eight points of bludgeoning damage as your body hits the ground. Boom. Tell me how you're landing, bro. Um. Basically, he put everything into these swings, and uh, he's gonna now look back to the rest of the group 
and be like, finish it, and sheathe his katana as he falls and land straight on his back and hold his arms out, preparing to catch her. At least you were the last one in the initiative for the turn order. They will not be able to finish it. However, you have hurt this thing severely, and it will make your checks so much easier to find out where just where Irina has gone as it continues to climb and disappears into the mist. I, I might be able to hit it, depending on how high up it goes. It's disappearing into the mist. I know where you're thinking. I know what you're I thinking. I up to 120 feet. If you could see it, <laughs> I would yeah. give that to you. It's moving into the mist. It's using... I'm not going to call it plot armor. <laughs> it's, it's, it's typing away. This is fucking plot armor, Cali. This is fucking plot armor. <laughs> I, I would have I let both of them fall to the ground if he had actually gotten the... Uh, it, it, like, if he had critted with the silver sword, it would have been over, bro. <laughs> it would have been fucking over. As they will disappear into the mist. You do see blood Hi, still falling. Irina. You do see blood still falling. Looking over. You see the werewolf kind of stop for a second. Looking down, looking back, knowing it wants to run, but barely being able to stand. I'm going to roll a d6. We're going to go 1 and 2 to X. Uh, 3 and 4 to Kane, and 5 and 6 to Arashi. I hope it attacks me. Damn. It's going to do X for the first and Kane for the second. Because it's going to snap like a wild dog. 14 to hit you, X. And 14 to hit you. I don't think that's going to hit either one of you. As it is still banged. It will just meet X's. X. You will take four points of piercing damage. I need another con saving throw from you. You will meet it. Yay. And as so, it will be your turn. Um. This one, I am. Did he take the, uh. The acid damage? Oh, yeah. He had not. He may... Go ahead and roll me that. Actually, you don't even have to roll me that. Tell me how your acid fucking kills this goddamn werewolf, because he only had one... He had a bee's dick worth of health left. And you are still up to full health. <clears throat> um, he, uh... The acid, which he didn't bother to wipe off, just keeps eating down to eating down, you know, as he's basically fold and it finally goes through his skull into his brain and then his head just kind of thunk oh oh ready um alright X and then in that case um can I like do like a sidestep to be halfway between uh Kane and Samael. Yeah, you like can you can you can so you can move through players unless stated otherwise. Uh, as long as okay. they're willing to let you move through players. Well, it's not that I want to move through them, it's just that I want to move a spell through them. Yes, you can move a spell through them. Alright. Yeah, in that case, uh both of them need to Make a DC 13 deck save. I am casting Natasha's Caustic Brew at level 2. Alright. Both of them taking, you said deck saves? Yep. 13. First one closest to you, second one after. First one passes, second one fails. Already? And the second one was the weekend one that already failed, so. Oh. 10 points of damage. 
Right. Uh, um, each creature in line must succeed on deck saving throw or be covered in acid for the spell's duration. All right, so the one in the back is covered in acid. Uh, I'm going to put degeneration on it. And they takes half, I'm guessing, right? Be covered in acid. Yeah, I believe so. Creature covered in acid takes 2d4. Oh, it's 44 because I cast it. Creature and the mine must succeed on a dex saving throw. Wait, did you say 44? Yep, 4d4. Wow. Yeah, because he cast it a second. No, I heard the second level part. So it doesn't. If you succeed, you do not take the take the damage. But the one in the back did, and oh, it okay. is covered. Already. So that is ten points of damage. Yeah. All right. So the front one does not take damage, but both, neither one of them looking very hot. Arashi, I think that moves to your turn. Yeah, oh, I'm just gonna target the one in front of me and get in between it and Kane. Um, I'm just gonna go with my long sword at it. All right, go for it. Twelve. Twelve hits. Oh, I thought it, I thought the DC was higher. God bless. You guys haven't found the DC technically yet. Mm -hmm. Damn. I. Oh. No. Do nothing. Oh. Well, uh, well, three points of damage there. She always forgets to to to. I'm do just gonna. Smite. I'm just gonna always yeah, make sure at the beginning of every one of your turns to just say smite. No, but I okay okay. Listen, I don't. You know, this is my first time playing a paladin, so like, would it still have hit with the nat one? That's why I didn't want to like. So I won't make you I won't make you expend the divine smite if you don't actually hit. Oh, okay. I that okay. Good to know. I'm an asshole, but I'm not that big of an asshole. Okay, it's okay, you. Arashi. It's, huh? okay. it's okay. Listen. We only lost the only person we were in charge of protecting, you know. We didn't <laughs> lose her. We're gonna find her. Arashi. Okay. You know where she went. Arashi. Yes. yes. Sorry. I need you to roll another attack as this thing decides to book it away from you. Oh. Oh. Divine smiting this one. <laughs> and, um, let me roll it. Tell it to Definitely hits. <laughs> okay. So there's the five, and then I need to do my two d six. Two d eight. Two d eight. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Paladin King over here. He is. Nine. For nine points of damage, it will definitely eat those that damage. As it does, it will spend all of its movement, literally. Dipping away. Word. You're all just cowards. As that will move us to Samael. Gonna move out to here. And see if I can see anything in the with my dark vision up in the sky. How far is your well? So it's not it's not forward. it's not the dark it's not the darkness that you can't see through. It's the mist that you can't see through. Okay. Then I'm gonna yell at Z and be like, hey, was that an undead? As I run past him. X, not All right. Z. <laughs> X. Alright, X. <laughs> no. Not it's undead not at all. Undead. No. They are looking for the disease. Mm. Alright, can I still see the other fucking werewolf that just ran away? You would be able to see the other werewolf that, that just ran away. Yeah. If you yeah, wanted well, to. He's about to get... 
Because even with double double movement, he's uh, he'd only be about uh, from where you're standing, about forty feet in front of you, give or take, forty maybe fifty feet. Yeah, does the twenty-two hit him? Yes. Okay, cool. <laughs> As he takes fifteen points of radiant damage to the back. Oh yeah, that would have been enough to kill him. He drops. <laughs> he only had fourteen health left. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> he fucking sniped him. <laughs> <laughs> no one <Damn> right. <laughs> way. Alright, that's my turn. No one. Since I can't way. see up in the sky. Cannot. Alright, I need 4d4 as we begin the uh this other guy's turn. Alrighty. Thirteen. Thirteen. He's not looking so hot. He, he looks over at Kami. He, he looks down. He's going to fucking risk it. Give me the attack of opportunity. You hit the fuck out of him, sir. I kind of want to just grapple him. But I'm going to hit him. 21 to hit. Hits. I don't even think you need to roll me damage, bro. Eight. Yeah, he only had three points of health. Give me that DPD as you slaughtered the last of the four werewolves. I just want to take this sword and shove it through his jaw all the way up as it just sticks out the top of his head. And just yank it out and let the blood pour out. As blood begins to spurt out from underneath, you guys do find yourself out of combat. As the and last as one come drops. Out of combat, I'm definitely going to use this card and bring it a spell slot back. Oops. <laughs> I am immediately going to run over and uh, start looking for the blood trail from the flying bird. Give me a survival check. I'm going to give him the assist. Okay, so what's your advantage? plus? What's your plus on that? Three. You want to help me do it? Uh, <laughs> if, you'll, if you'll let me, I said it first. But... I mean, if I'll you want to help it, me. I'll allow it. Okay. I'll allow it. I'll allow okay. it. Okay. I figured your whole party would start looking for this. Because I just net 20 that bitch. You. It, it's. It's a very straight, well, not, I'm not going to call it straight. It's west. It's the direction you guys were headed anyhow. It does actually go west. Now, Kami, you could smell mm -hmm. it, bro. Something's wrong with this blood. It's not human. No, it, it's human. It is human. No, 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 it's not. Was it similar to the blood I tasted in the werewolf? It's got a wrongness to it, but it is the same style of wrongness that came with that werewolf. Okay. I'm going to lick it. You taste that, uh, that, you get that little bit of burning sensation. I'm just going to spit. But and be like... As you spit it out. Kind of reminds me a little bit of chicken. <laughs> well, it was definitely like a bird. There's something fucking weird on it. It didn't taste right. Yes, it must have been afflicted by the disease, too. What disease? Lycanthropy. Lycanthropy? They have no idea what you're talking about. What was about. that? What are you talking about, sir? As I'm sort of walking down, following the trail a little bit. They you... are humans infected with a magical disease given them by wolves, ravens, bears, boars. And they lose the ability during a full moon 
at least the first time, to control their change. Mm. They are affected by silver weapons. Thanks for that, by the way. Mm -hmm. Glad I could help. I wish I could have helped save the girl. Well, yeah. we're She's a tough looking after that path. Back. <laughs> Do you know a lot about these curses? Um, I know they're beyond you... my means to cure. Like, do you know anything about uh, vampirism? Um, do I know about vampirism? Come back, let's see You do not know about vampirism. You know, you know more about lycanthropy. No, I'm, unfortunately, vampirism isn't one of my areas of study. Roll me an arcana check. X. Alrighty. We're going to see just how much you know or don't know. Not much today. Not much today. You don't know why, but you get the sensation that the werewolves that were just fought were weaker than they could have been. Now, these guys seemed a little like they were pups when it comes to being lycanthropes. Mm hmm well, do you you said you just got like dropped in here, right? Like you just kind of woke up here? Uh I woke up here about a day and a half ago. Um, and I'll hold up my right hand and it's it's it doesn't look like my other hand, my left hand. It's I'm just gonna say it. <laughs> it's okay. wooden. His hands wooden. So you're going to recognize pretty quickly. Yeah. Did you I get know. attacked by little bushes? Yes. And one it, of their quills went through my staff and into my hand. Is my it arm. still spreading? No, I was able to stop it. Arashi, give me, give me, uh, give me a perception check. Oh shit! Was uh, it in? Okay. No. <laughs> so you didn't, you didn't find like a little. Uh, what? How would y'all describe that? Like a little wooden worm thingy. Ish. The splinter that moved on its own. Yes, I did. And you uh, got it out. I got it out. And you'll see a a, a a cut mark, a rather fresh cut mark up by his elbow. Huh. So did it? It took you a while to find it, I guess. Yes. Boy. Then it took me a little bit to get it out. I had to. That acid stings quite a bit. Tommy. Yeah, I had to burn it off. Check, buddy. I had to burn it off somebody. Who did I burn it off? Debbie? No, you burned oh, it off. Kane's. Kane's yeah, Kane's. Yeah, I burned it off Kane's so... butt cheek. <laughs> yeah, that was barking. <laughs> His ass was barking. <laughs> Who needs to give a perception check, you said? You do. Oh, me. Fuck. You're talking to him. Yep. 17. He, see something. he, he is going to see something. And I didn't tell Wiz this. <laughs> Up his arm, you see black tendrils. Uh, okay, man. So, we just met you. And this is crazy, but here's my number. So call me, maybe. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't think you got it out, bro. Wait, what? I'm gonna come this calm. Uh, I'm gonna like I'll grab my sleeve and yeah, I'm gonna roll up your sleeve up. and have these like the black tendrils out. 
Are the tendrils like moving? They're not moving. But they're very distinctly different from the wood. They're very distinctly different than his gem skin. Ah. How healthy are you right now? Well. Not for long. <laughs> Not for long. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna light a light my torch from the fire. The moment that this happens, X, you feel an immense panic just wash <laughs> over you. Arashi, hold him down. Okay. I'm going to instantly try and uh, hold him down. That would be like a strength check. Try not to struggle here. We're not. I promise you we're not trying to kill you or hurt you. We're just trying to help save you. Okay. But this is going to hurt. I know where this is going. Oh, I'm singeing the fuck out of it. Where, are you, where I... exactly are you trying to singe? So... How far up is his arm wooden? Wait, well, that's up to you. How I far? Think it was about to about, about to his here. forearm. Yeah. Okay, and I'm assuming then the tendrils are like elbow-ish. Then yes, it, it's 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 probably moving. Like, if this is where it stops, it's yeah. probably you probably have a few wisps that are probably have moved past his elbow. Okay, like I'm not trying to burn the actual wood that is his hand in fear of just making his hand fall off. I'm trying to stop the spread and kill what's there to see if we can get it to go back normal. Okay. So I'm going to start burning at the elbow. Let me D8. X, you're going to take five points of fire damage as he begins to burn this. As you two, as one of you is holding him down and Kami is going, and you're very specifically focused on this, I will give you advantage, both of you. Perception checks, please. Okay. X is like, what the hell is going on right now? I see Wind. It's like, what the fuck, bro? We didn't talk about this. <laughs> Yeah, we did. Right. You're right. There's a lot of things. So uh, I, I will give you a heads up for the for the rest of the team. I have plans for everybody. I After you told me the direction you wanted to go, I'm running with it. That doesn't say that you know everything. <laughs> Tommy. Yes. With your check. You see the ones. Say you're burning on the top. The tendrils recede, and at the bottom, you see one, two, no, three. It seems that whatever bark is still there is starting to multiply. The tendrils grow longer on the underside, while they grow shorter on the top. I'm going to grab the bottom ones and try to rip them out. As you try... You notice that they just seem to keep multiplying. It seems whatever whatever was in there was only a starting point. Well, fuck, man. Take the arm. Uh -huh. Now I'm not saying to take his arm, but he's I, been here for a day. Is... He's been here for a while. He has slowed it. He has slowed it down immensely. This is beyond what I know how to handle, man. We can try to cut off your arm, but I don't think that's the right play. No, 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 no. Let me try something first. And I'm going to um, hold his arm. Okay. Oh, hold on. Actually. <laughs> Actually. I'm just going to, I'm just going to, you know, how I'm holding him, like, however I'm holding him. I guess like the shoulder, you know? So I'm going to keep my hands there. Oh, one of my hands there. Uh, keep my right hand where the ten, like the arm of the tendrils are, and then my left hand is holding onto my amulet. Say, Tear, please hear me. <laughs> and then, do I have to roll, or can I actually like act out like what I'd say? What exactly are you trying to do? I want to ask Tear to um, 
either you're praying you're praying to god you're not using any abilities you're praying to god is that what you're telling me uh, uh, yes <laughs> okay that's fine uh, uh wait 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 okay so i would be using hardest divine power but that's my question to you too actually let me ask this i want to ask tier right if he could either help him like stop it for him or help me stop it and by harnessing divine power i take back a spell slot so i could use um another divine smite because i have no spell slots left that's what i play it. what you're doing are, are, are you using the the harness divine to contact try to contact tier or are you trying to do it for a spell you gotta you gotta choose one you can't do both <laughs> There, there's actually a mechanic for for what you're trying to do. So I remember, and I don't know if I can do the consecutive numbers again, bro. I feel like <laughs> I, I never get it. Um, well, you're a low level. It's it's very difficult to get four consecutive yeah. numbers and actually come out right. So okay, this is my question to you: Is if I do decide to hit him with divine smite, is it possible to just like? Do what I need to, or would I end up cutting his arm off if I were to use it, kind of thing? Or can I not know? No, if you f if you fail, I don't, I'm not gonna get, like I'm not gonna force you to chop the man's arm off. Like <laughs> uh, <okay. laughs> the man needs his arm, but okay. if you fail, tear tear's not gonna answer, and it's going to it, it, it does it's going to be difficult. So if that's what but you yeah, want to do, just, I'm just I'm just gonna get the spell slot back. The spell slot back. Oof. All right, Wiz. I'm gonna need you to check your Discord. Alright? In just a minute. Yeah. Is it just me or did Drake cut out? Okay, maybe I disconnected. No, no. You're, no, you're still here. Oh, Just stop okay. talking. Does this make sense of what I'm saying, Wiz? Oh. Yeah. There you go. And this gives you a reason to travel with the party. Okay. Yes, almost exactly like that. Was. Okay. <laughs> and you can you can tell them you can tell them what you need to, right? Uh, that that is that hidden. I'm just more or less what you tell them or what you don't tell them is up to you. Well. The reason it hasn't gone any further is because of my magic and maybe my psionics. What do you mean? Huh. And uh, I'm going to send a message directly to Arashi in her mind saying, this is what I mean. What? I, 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 I'm gonna no 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 I don't say that to you guys I I just you just see Rashi's face kind of like her eyebrows start to like bend in together because she's like what but in her mind she's saying it back to him like what are you talking about like I don't understand I can speak to anyone that I can see with my mind and I was gonna say I can speak to anyone mind. I can see oh, too. Yeah. Yeah, Hi, like, Sam. <laughs> Just kidding. You guys wouldn't hear this, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, only no, I, know, I, know. I know. Yeah, it's like, I can do that because of Sirion, my ultimate mother. Sirion, you say. Now Arashi's got a smile on her face because she loves living in people's like, beliefs and everything because she doesn't know what that means. What is that? Sirion is the sister of 
Bahamut and Tiamat. Okay, how do you spell that? S <laughs> I O R O N, I think. S I O R O N. Okay, okay. And what exactly does she let you do? What, 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 tell me more, please. I can. Uh, I can speak to people with my mind. That's it? Plus, she allows me to breathe thunder damage. B breathe? Dad, you saw when the two loud booms sounded? Yeah, I just assumed it was part of the atmosphere. You never know what you're going to get out here, to be honest. I that don't was, know how you got here. That was my breath weapon. You know, it's kind of funny, because I don't know how I got here either. That makes two of you, I think... Because uh, our buddy sent my L over there. He uh, he also. Did. But apparently that woman, you know, that got taken. No, this is between us, you know, because they're gonna make jokes. Ignore their jokes about me, by the way. But that's his girl that he can't seem to remember. But he still has a thing for. Her. You know, it's kind of complicated. Anyway, yes, 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 yes. Sorry. Sure. Um, Sirion. <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, she is the uh, between Bahamut, Sirion, and uh -huh. Diamet. Yeah. Oh. They created reality. They, cre they created, created reality together? My material plane. Yes, the three of them did. And then Tiamat got jealous and killed her. Oh. Well, actually, no. Sorry. I don't think that's quite right. It was the other gods that got jealous and killed her. What gods? Not Tyr, right? T I have no idea. This is in time in ages past. Close oh, to yeah. basically the begin close to the beginning of time. Wow, that's a long time. Time immemorial. <laughs> I was okay. thinking about that, using that exact phrase. Yep. Well, uh, I'm going to just uh, look at everyone else with a big smile on my face. Yo, so this guy's cool, right? So um... <laughs> This dude's cool. <laughs> it doesn't change the fact that he's got shit growing out of his arm. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Yo, yeah, about that. I'm going to put my notebook away now, you know? like, But I, I actually didn't take it out. So anyway. But yeah, so, um, so how does that help with the tendrils, though? I say this out loud now. I say this out loud. I, I believe it's allowing me to keep them at bay, at least slowing them down so that um, I don't turn. Mm. So that's great, but I'm still going to have to divine smite your brother. So anyway, um, we're going to try this the nice way. Can I still use divine smite if I were to attack with my hand like yank or anything? Are you trying to chop his arm off? That's what I said. No, I said with what your hand. You yeah, like, I'm trying to take the tendrils, essentially. And, like, that's why I asked if I did this, would I cut his hand, his arm off? I said no. The way Divine Might, Divine Might should read is when you make a melee attack. Yeah, that's why. So, okay, so... You trying to pray to the gods wasn't going to constitute as a failure cutting his arm off. But you taking your sword... <laughs> And swinging it straight down using your divine power directly onto his arm, yeah, yeah, you're probably gonna take his arm off. <laughs> no, she's she's doing it with her hand though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Not my sword, it's my mm. hand. That's what I was like. Well, that, can I do that? It, how many martial arts forms have open hand strikes? <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I'm out of she, could, she could literally just slap my the underside of my arm. And set the divine smite off. Roaming inside, Jack. Me? Yeah, you. With that banshee? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Does the 16 do it? Yeah. <clears throat> this is physically going to hurt him a lot. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> I'm waiting for him to say more. I'm waiting for him to say more. 
<laughs> I'm waiting for her to say more. Hold on, I gotta clip that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wait, okay. <laughs> but anything else or that's it? This is gonna hurt him a lot. Uh huh. I don't know how they're going to take it. The tendrils. So that's it. Okay. So I'm gonna. <laughs> I, we hear you. We hear you. By the way. Oh, but okay. So she's gonna come down and try to crush his like. Possibly either break his elbow or fracture his arm is what she's going for right now. Okay. So I'm going to look at X and say, um, <laughs> you, you still want that arm, bro? <laughs> hey, you still want that arm, bro? Yeah, yeah I kind of need it. I think, okay. I think this might be beyond us, guys. We might just bro, need to I look. Hearing this? Dev, mute yourself on True Comp. What? Mute yourself on True Comp. I can hear the clip replaying. <laughs> Okay. Oh yeah, your voice is on in true. Yeah, that's why I'm like I could still hear it. And I'm like, why do I keep <laughs> hearing the same thing over and over again? Okay, sorry. Okay, you said what? I, I would I would fracture his arm. I think this is beyond our capability. I think we let it go. He has it stifled, and we see if we can find someone who actually has dealt with this and knows how to take care of it. Okay, listen, sir. Listen, I I'm about to ask X. I'm about to say X. So um. There's no guarantee this will fix it, but I'm not trying to take the chances of it advancing any further. Would you be okay if I used a, uh, how would I de describe device my to someone? Um, I'm just going to lean into him while she's sitting here talking about it and be like, it's okay to say no. I yes, encourage it is okay you to say, to no. say no. Okay, listen. <laughs> You don't even know what I'm thinking, but it's okay if I were to give a little slap to your arm with a radiant damage. See yeah, about finding someone in a close by village if they have any idea, and if they don't, we can talk it over some more. That's fine with me. All right, let's let's go. Let's go. Dread, you were I'm muted, by the way. I'm just sitting here, like you know. <laughs> Is it okay if I uh, snap your arm like a fucking twig? Cause it's basically a twig right now. Let me let me let me break your arm like a twig. <sighs> okay. I was doing careful <laughs> surgery with a torch. You're trying to fucking smite holy hell into his arm. Why is it showing my entire path? What the? All right. This is ridiculous. Um, we're still because I still order. haven't had yeah because oh. I still haven't. Taken anyway, anyway, on to kind of. That. On to kind of some information since, you know, you have a stick mm. arm and mm. we're just obviously a group of fucking crazies. Uh, mm. Do you know of a man named Strahd? He does not. Okay. So <laughs> we all got brought here, I think, in a similar fashion to what I think you did. Where we just kind of showed up here. And there's this dude that runs around. We, we a... were drugged by the Vistani and brought yeah. here. Yeah. But we ended up here not knowing how we got here. Um, but there's a dude who basically, like, runs the streets out here. His name is Strahd. Uh, and he is a vampire. Uh, vampires are undead and drink blood for sustenance and have other abilities we'll say um and i will kill him kane doesn't really like vampires um yeah and this guy with the face mask on he's some kind of celestial thing that's apparently been here before but doesn't remember it that's no one. idea no <laughs> idea and this is Arashi... the recap episode without the recap episode yeah, Arashi is like deeply in love with vampires. A good Stop person off. who's Stop in off. love with vampires. Stop up. Look, what I, remember what I told you, X? Ignore me. And, and I am also a vampire, apparently. I didn't come here that way, but I am now that way. 
Uh, which, I mean, I guess we haven't really talked, Kane, since uh, you found out. Um, but, yeah, uh, I am apparently a vampire that was turned that way by Strahd, and we're trying to figure out how to, one, get back to where we're going, but probably also kill this fucker. So... What, what was your question? I was just saying that I like the idea of killing them. Yeah, we just don't know how or, you know, where. He's invited us to dinner. And we probably need to go to that at some point. But Arashi was uh, taken by him. I'm assuming he's smitten with her and loves her. So huh? we were <laughs> charged with we were charged with protecting her by her brother. And we've now failed at that, so we should probably try to get her back. Everybody, yeah, agree? that was that wasn't Arena. a rash. It's Arena. That's why. That's Sorry, why. Arena, not Arashi. Sorry, Arena. <laughs> Names. I'm just saying, right now, you've got you've got a monster hunter paired with a vampire assassin, a Ooh. dude who doesn't re like doesn't remember who or what he is. Fucking being haunted by a ghost. A holy woman who is in love with vampires. <laughs> and a dragonborn who's turning into a tree. This is a fantastic party. I mean, you'll fit right in with us. <laughs> so, uh, I was able to get a pretty good nick on that bird thing. Uh, so hopefully we can follow that blood trail. Did you were you able to pick it up, uh, Sam and Kane? Oh yeah, it, it's yeah. clear as day. Okay. Yeah, if you guys are done fucking around, we should go. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I thought you'd have more to say about me being a vampire, but I mean, I guess you're I not gonna kill me. You I'm good. Talk about that later. I'm giving I mean, you, I'm giving you the RP chance. Here's your, here's your chance at an RP <laughs> session. It, okay. it, it's not it's not uh, uh, so it's, it's not gonna it's not gonna change the uh the dynamic the of what's gonna happen yeah okay. if yeah. you're good with it man I, i'm down to squash it but i figured now's as good as time any i'm not okay with it i'm not either <laughs> i didn't ask for it but I'm making the best I can of this shitty situation. Yes, man. he did. Don't but, fucking let him lie to you. The cabbie fucking asked for it all around, bro. <laughs> Kami didn't. Cappy did, but Kami didn't. <laughs> all I know is I've been this way since that night with Strahd. Uh, I've been... I haven't killed anyone for blood. Uh, I made a deal with the villagers in the town to give me blood, and I helped them, you know sustain their lifestyle actually get better than their lifestyle i was paying them an ass load of money for their blood um but i'm not trying to kill anybody other than strad for doing this to me if i do do something bad kill me but you bet your ass <laughs> sam has already said he'll do it so if i'm doing something you don't agree with Tell me. If I won't stop, kill me. I don't know I'll how much... That. Just don't... Don't step out of line. I might Dude. try experimenting on you first to figure out how to kill you before we go find Strahd, if you do. Can you define what's out of line? Because that's a pretty yeah. wide berth, man. Yeah, that's pretty vague. I'm not going to lie. I'm wondering the same thing, if I'm in danger or not. No. What, if, if you lose control, or if you do kill someone... That doesn't deserve to die. Let's put that... An in innocent. We'll say an innocent. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'll be the first one to kill him. Don't you guys worry. <laughs> All right. That man's head well, off. then, since everybody knows now, I'm going to go into my undead form. Yeah. <laughs> And I'm just going to be like, this is what I look like. Um, Daru is also a vampire. I was able to help him. Um, but this is what we look like 
at our most dangerous. And then I'll drop my undead form. That's why you guys didn't allow me in that basement. Mm-hmm. Correct. Yeah. That's right. I didn't want you to kill him when we had a chance to save him. Just because someone's afflicted with a disease doesn't mean they deserve to die. Especially when we can fix it. Wait, are we not are we not gonna have to like roll for uh anything? Since he dropped his form. I wasn't trying to fear I wasn't trying to scare you guys. Oh, so it's only if you're trying to? Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. That's a different thing. My undead form just increases my deck score and does a bunch of other shit. It's if I go deathly horror that I try to scare you. Okay, okay, cool. I thought well, you were trying to charm her. No, that's later. Okay. <laughs> I'm saving that for an opportune moment. But, all right. Anybody got any questions? Is this guy strong? How fast can we kill him? Uh, I think he's at his castle. And I don't know if we can kill him yet. He's <laughs> strong as fuck. <laughs> I mean, all these creatures that, like, you just saw. The werewolves and that bird, like... Those are his minions, and oh, we've great. fought countless of them on our way here. So, somebody who can command that kind of presence, I think, is probably a little too strong for us still. Sounds right. You back, Orange? Yeah. Okay. No, like it was weird. I could I couldn't hear you guys, but I saw you guys talking on the stream and everything, so I was really confused. No, you good. I saw your thing. You said you DC'd. Yeah. But, all right. Then onward and forward. Let's follow this blood trail. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And uh, make sure to tell us if those tendrils start advancing, please. Yep, yep, okay. that's, that's it. You missing right. your girlfriend yet, SMIO? <laughs> You looking for Strahd? Shut up, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> I could say the same thing about you. Uh, Fucking that shit. Listen, listen, I was charmed. There's a difference. I don't even know who she is. I'm just trying to I figure do. shit out. You do now. You? All right. All Where's right. the blood trail, chief? So you're going to follow the road, all right? Mm -hmm. Basically, from where you're at, I'm going to... Do you want to be on the road? Or do you mm -hmm. not want to be on the road? So it, the it trail itself the trail does is. not necessarily follow the road, but it does go in one specific direction. I'm going to follow the path of the blood. Yeah. All right. I agree. I think yeah. we follow the blood trail. And we should be running. <laughs> you're yeah. running? Yeah. This isn't yeah. this isn't quiet or methodical. Okay. Let me calculate. Two. Five. Seven. Give me a second. I gotta calculate Four everything out. Wait, you know something I, I forgot, guys? What? <laughs> I don't know how I forgot this. I'm a, <laughs> I'm a half elf. <laughs> I have advantages against being charmed. I forgot about this this entire time. Well, <laughs> there's now an addendum in there. Advantage of getting charmed except by vampire. No, by except no, by no, vampire. No, 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 no. It's not happened yet. The last time I'm using that advantage. I would like to charm Arashi right now. I would like to give him guidance. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So all together, after everything that's happened, I'm looking at 8 a.m., but you guys have actually made it uh, with running. Cool, 8 a.m. Okay. 8 a.m. Sun has officially risen. All right. Well, as much as it can rise in Barovia, right? Huh? Still Barovia. All right, and as far as can't 
me to interrogate somebody. Coming in hot. Where's Rachel? As you actually notice this, you notice that it is going directly towards windmill, a little bit off in the distance. You see multiple birds flying overhead. Now, the old slick road that you were on transitions here from uh, being a windy path through the mountains to a lazy trail that hugs the mountainside as it descends into a fog-filled valley. In the heart of the valley, you see a walled town, maybe? Near the shores of a great mountain lake, its water's dark and still. The branch of the road, the one that you guys are on, leading west to a prominent or uh, uh, to a windmill. Atop which is perched, dilapidated, run down, its warped wooden veins stripped bare. The windmill itself appearing to turn and then all of a sudden it goes back and forth, almost like it's been locked. Now, a little bit more of a, as you guys come a little bit closer, you notice that it's an onion domed edifice leaning towards or leaning forward into one side as though trying to turn away from the stormy gray sky. You see gray bricks, walls, and dirt-covered windows on the upper floors. A decrepit wooden platform encircles the windmill above a flimsy doorway leading to the building's interior. Perched on a wooden beam above the door, however, you see a rather large bird? No, that's not a bird. That's way too big. It's wearing clothes. And it's holding something. A woman. It seems that you have, in fact, found Arena. And hops around and squawks at you, seeming agitated. And as it does... <clears throat> a second here. As I have to bring all of your character tokens in. So it spotted us as well, huh? Oh, it hasn't just spotted you. It's been waiting. It's been I announced watching. I was coming in hot. You guys yeah. have been running, so. Oh no, no, no! I was coming in hot, like I thought I was coming in swinging. As you do. I need to activate this. Oh, shoot. You guys are basically headed in west in that direction. Don't move just yet. I see what you're doing. Calm your roll. Hmm. Calm your tits, Dev. I know I'm what you're just doing. checking, okay? I'm checking to see how far it is. Back. I know no. what he's trying to do. Trying to get your boyfriend to come hang out. I don't have a boyfriend. Thank you very much. Yet. As it flies, it'll fly all the way up. <laughs> And it flutters down on top, right on top of this tree. Is it holding arena still? It is not. It's just kind of standing there looking at you, kind of giving you the side, you know, birds see better out the side of the eye, just kind of giving you the side eye. Where's arena? Where's Rachel? Is Safe. this the same one? That we injured, or? I don't know. Give me a perception check. Uh, I can't. Tommy sees a big oh, old bird, bro. So is oh, Kane. I'll do perception. Okay. Semi, you see a big old bird, bro. I cheated. Good I job. Cheated. You guys, you guys are on point, bro. It's a big old bird. <laughs> Bird is the word. Not bird. 
What's your name? Feather. What? Feather. Feather. Feather? Where's Irina? <clears throat> with with mother. Where's Safe. mother? Safe. Where's mother? Safe from what? Dude, do what Strahd wants. Fuck, this ain't got time for your shit. I'm wouldn't wouldn't do that. Wouldn't do that. Mother angry. Mm -hmm. We don't do what Strahd wants. Mm. Hey, Feather. Feather. It's turns and looks at you. Fuck your mother. <laughs> Wrong yeah, choice. That's not nice. Oh. Don't don't say Feather didn't warn you. Hey, hey, Feather, what is your mom like? <laughs> Money, but afraid of straw guys afraid i'm gonna stop right here why can't you just run from straw <laughs> no one runs from straw nowhere nowhere to go if you give us Irina, we could probably take care of straw not my choice do what mother says can uh, we talk to your mother don't recommend saw you before Okay, but and? that's not our fault. She she took our friend. We didn't know who she was. We thought she was a uh, an enemy. You know, we can be friends. We thought she worked for Strahd. Yeah. We're trying to keep Irene Does work safe for Strahd. from Strahd. Does work for Strahd. Everyone works for Strahd. But it's different if you're working for Strahd because you like Strahd or because you're scared of Strahd. No difference. Uh-oh. There is a difference, right? Right, guys? I'm going to change Ever. my undead form. And I'm going to change my tone and be like, all right, you passed the test. We're actually here for Shrod. Uh We're here to get Irina and take her to him. Roll me a deception check. Can we assist him with it? Yeah. Shit. There's going to be a flat roll because you use your undead form, but. Lies. Lies. Now, have you. What? Why would we lie to you? You see his form. Rejected. Strahd... Re 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 rejected Strahd's offer. Strahd angry. Mother afraid. Can we just go in, guys? Well, I mean, if Strahd, if we make Strahd angry, he'll come at us and not you. So if you give her to us, he'll just continue to be mad at us. Strahd, Strahd, Strahd wants girl. Strahd gets what Strahd wants. Not today. <laughs> All right, I guess we're going to keep going then. Yep. Just kind of turns and around. turns and looks down down towards you again. Wouldn't do it. Feather warned. Thanks for the warning, Feather. The warning. Bye. Uh, Hopefully your cowardice doesn't get you killed one day. It's gonna, he's he's going to start kind of batting his wings a little bit. He just kind of lifts up and takes off. Right into the sky. Walk with you guys. Oh, okay. Feather, take me with you. Feather will disappear. Feather! <laughs> this feather flies forward. Seems you guys have made your decision. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is the uh, this is how you guys are going forward. Yeah, I think yeah. you guys cool with that. That's fine. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, I'll stay behind the paladin so she can tank the first shots. <laughs> yeah, I'll let her go first. I'm down for that. Give me a little quick second here. Hmm. You guys have walked like that. 
Got to try to find you guys here. How'd you guys actually see you guys were like that? You I'm staying in my undead form, by the way. And then I had you back here. Where the fuck did Kane go? He's right beside me. No, it's not like that. That's not what I was talking about. As you guys do finally make it to the last place, the windmill would be right here. Before you start moving, however, you do see Feather fly in. And if it would load, that would be fantastic for me. That's what it did. All right, give me a second. Comes and perches himself directly above. Alarm! Alarm! Hmm. Last chance! Can you just give me a perception check? Everybody? Mm-hmm. Damn. Oh, you perceive shit, This fog is just... I see almost nice everything. Both birds. Samuel. Yeah. You look up. There's a lot of fucking birds, man. And the more he squeaks, the more there seems to be. Are these the same kind of birds that have been following us around? These are, in fact, ravens. Hmm. What are you doing with Irina? She sleeps. Yeah, that's not what I asked. I asked, what are you doing with her? Waiting for pickup. By who? Black carriage. All feather nose. I'm going to look back at the group and be like, Wait for a sneak attack on the carriage? Bush? I mean, we could try that now. I mean, seems like a better idea than fighting Mother, right? Give me a history check now. Oh, oh, never mind. By me? All of you. Uh-oh. Natural one. That's six. I got better than you. There we go. There's a net. There's a good one. Which is fucked up because Zars for our X is the only one who wouldn't know. I know. But with a nat 20, I'm going to give it to him. Only because he got a nat 20. <clears throat> you saw the black or carriage earlier while you were moving around and right before you got attacked by those bushes. There was a an elven fellow folk driving that thing. He, uh, he was in control of something. Very finely dressed. He pulled off and looked like he was waiting on somebody. I saw a black carriage yesterday sometime before this happened. It was an elven fellow. And uh, he was dressed rather finely. He had pulled off the side of the path and he was seemed like he was waiting on someone. That might have been us. Mm, was it by a bridge? It wasn't by a bridge, but it was by the gate. It was Big by gate. gate. Big one. Yes, the that's gate where we, we walked through. Yeah. All right, so it's that guy. We I don't know if we want to fight that guy. We know that guy. 
Strahd's delivery man. Yeah, he's Strahd's bitch. He so prefers the term it? manservant. Yeah, I stand by what I say. <laughs> um, hmm. It's up to you guys. What do you want to do? We can wait and try to ambush him. I mean, that certainly is going to get Strahd's fucking attention. Um, it's also going to get rid of one of his henchmen. Yeah. <laughs> Kill him. Maybe. Yeah. I mean, Strahd's probably not going to take kindly to us attacking his body servant person. Would he really care? Yeah, Most likely. Uh, arena, probably. <laughs> I mean, we you all saw, I mean, except for you, X, I mean, we all saw how bad he wants her. Carriage would be a much better way of getting around. Very true. So you want to kill him and take the carriage? Are we even sure we can kill him? No. Nope. We want to try. Dude, you guys this is try. a pretty big impasse here, guys. Like, we need to decide which fight we're going to take here. Yeah, I'm down. <sighs> I mean, Arashi just wants to kill people that are evil. And that dude's definitely evil. She's just worried about the power difference. So I'm down for what the group is down for. As you guys are sitting discussing it, a door opens. And while he's about, at this point, I would say probably about 40 feet in the air. So let me, uh, 40 feet in the air. An old woman walks out, hunched over, using a cane. Very white hair. Very not attractive in any way, shape, or form. Wart on the side of the nose. Wart on the yeah. chin. Deucer, anyway. <laughs> as, as she walks out. Uh, what, what's all this alarm? What trouble have you brought to our doorstep now, Feather? Oh, she oh just don't talk to my friend forward. Feather like that. You don't tell me what I do or do not with my children. Oh. You must be mother. Yeah, you must be mother. Hi, mother. Um, <laughs> they call me Bella. They call you what? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm not the mother. I'm, I'm Bella. But make no difference. <laughs> the feather's still mine. They're all mine. <laughs> It is a pleasure to meet you. Feather was just talking about you. And he seems delightful. I'm, <laughs> I'm sure they are. Yes, yes, yes. I'm sure they are. Um, yes, as my friend here and I, my friends, I'm sorry, but I'm going to point at Kami and just like, you know, say like, come up, like, come up closer. Um, we're here for Strahd. <sighs> I know exactly who you are. <laughs> you're the you're the ones that have decided to <laughs> defy Strahd, yes. Uh, that's a terrible choice. Uh, but to each their own, you know. <laughs> How do you know who we are? Uh, well, everyone everyone knows who you are. You're you're, you're gonna be the next dead meat. <laughs> Uh, you're the new play. You're the new playthings. But here we are. You're the new playthings. Um, Everybody hmm. else we ran into is thought the same thing. We're still here. Yeah, and I'd say it's been pretty fun. And I'm just gonna, you know, give her. A little Maybe you're push. our playthings. <laughs> Would you like that? <laughs> Would you like that, young man? <laughs> she starts licking her lips. You missed a spot. I wouldn't miss a single thing. <laughs> Not with you. <laughs> oh, are you, you know, into my friend here? I'm going to look back at Samael, give him a wink, and just take a step to the side. Oh. As I begin casting a spell. Oh, my God. What are you casting? I'm excited. Hold on a minute. 
say. I'm assuming that's what you want me to do. <laughs> when I when I'm asking you to get involved, obviously that's what I want you to do. <laughs> uh. All right, go ahead. Uh, wisdom saving throw, DC fifteen. Wisdom saving throw, <clears throat> DC fifteen. See if this works. Come on. I'm weird. Damn it. Nineteen is it will fail. What were you trying to cast? Hold person. All right. Oh no. That wasn't as cool as I wanted it to be. <laughs> it would have been cooler if it would have run off. All right. Because we could have just walked up and just like murked her. As this begins to happen, you see Bella just kind of move her head to the side just ever so slightly. The back, her back begins to straighten out. Oh, God. Her hair. A lot better if it would have worked. Turns a lot more. It grows down. Horns start to become... Her fingers elongate. You see them start to turn to claws. As she turns herself into a single type of hag. As she looks up. And you only hear one word. Sisters! Sisters. Sweet. Sisters. Sweet. Was that plural? That, that is, plural. in fact, plural. <laughs> and as we are at 1015, you start to see a few things happen. I mean, we aren't leaving without this woman, so. Yeah. One way or another, we're not leaving without her. Damn, these things were hiding. No, they were out. They were above us. They were flying around on top of us. Oh, they're the ones above us? Oh, they are the oh, ones oh, above oh. you. There <laughs> are just multiple. Who's got that fireball to throw up in the air? Yeah, right. It's got to have something to actually hit. Spellcaster. There are multiple swarms of ravens. They'll begin oh, to start swarms. to descend. Yay. Swarms suck. You hear from Feather as she calls out for sisters. Mother selling pastries. That woman from town, but. My character doesn't know that. It's selling pastry. My character knows that. Does in fact. As you've met, mother. I am so glad I didn't try to kill her. Oh my god. <laughs> no. Now so you glad I didn't try to kill her back then. Now you understand why she wants to take the children. It would have been a very, oh, very God. bad move, and I was waiting. It would have been a very, very bad move for you to attack <laughs> Mother. Kami would have fucking Spied died. Spied himself. He was Kami would have died. Dolo. Yep. Kami would have oh, died. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, Sessions later. Literally, that was like session two, right? Mm -hmm. That was a hot minute ago. Yeah, it was like session one or two. No, uh, it was like three. It was like session. No, three, it was it was. Uh, no, it was like it was probably five. Like seven. Seven? I thought that you already yeah. met with her. Well, not like no, you went into, went into the house. Before. It was when you guys went to the ho back to the hotel, and I went to get make the deal with the family for blood. It was before you guys even went. It was before you guys even went to the cave. Yeah. yeah, be right back. That was a. Really it was your first. It was your first night in town. I think it was either session three or session four. Mm. I'm looking for it. It was probably about session uh, four. 
session four or five because session yeah. two and three would have been inside the uh the house mm -hmm. yeah but it was after i got turned by strahd so yep yeah, I think, but you started... And session playing. four was definitely the when you got turned then. Yeah, so it probably was five, actually. But she called for sisters. Yeah. Okay, well, you know, at least one of them's not here. That's now. mother. That's mother. But it's probably one of her sisters. Because it seems you guys have not run across and have decided to attack mm -hmm. a coven. Yeah. Fuck it. I'm going to yell Daru, see if he'll come help. <laughs> but that is where we will end up. Now you understand why I was trying to get you guys to do a little bit of RP and whatnot before, uh, before we got mm -hmm. to this. Because I knew we weren't going to run right into another battle. I was very specific when I told you guys you guys weren't going to live if you were trying to play kill hobos. Yeah. Or murder hobos. You know, they took the chick. So we have to try yeah. to save her. I don't know another way around this without, you know, with us trying to get her back. I don't want to abandon her to Strahd till later. I might not have a choice, but... Mm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that'll be it for the, for us tonight. I'm gonna set up a raid and then uh, we'll uh, we'll head out for the night. Appreciate you guys coming Dang. back to play and uh, happy Thanksgiving to everybody. Since we yeah, won't be back until afterwards, I'm gonna have to bite so many things to try to heal. It's uh, I'm half health. It's gonna be interesting. Yeah. Um, it's all from the fucking fall damage. I wasn't hurt until I ran I'll from the one this. werewolf. And yeah, it was session me. eight. It was session eight. I found it. Really? That's when seems he, like it was before that. that. Either way, that's when he. That's when he made that deal. Yeah. Have a good night, everybody. And uh, oh, good night. Good night. we'll good see night. you around for the next one. Deuces. Uh, uh, yeah, you ended shoot already. <laughs> I'm so sorry.